Good morning, guys. It is 6 1 a.m. Oh my god. Last night was one of the longest, roughest, tiring nights of my entire life. I didn't go to bed till late, I fell asleep till late. I went, went to sleep in basically my clothes. I mean, I changed my pants, but I went to sleep in my shirt because I didn't I just didn't feel like changing. It was just not a good night. It's not a normal night. I didn't, I didn't really work out. I mean, I had gym yesterday, but I didn't really work out. I, I didn't watch The Bachelor. I watched my music lesson, but you know, that was before this all the chaos started. But I'm not going to get into it. Let's just say it's going to be a little awkward today at school. But hopefully today will be a better day than yesterday because yesterday I was hoping that it would be a, a good day and it wasn't. And last night, that's what, why I'm wearing this, my big comfy jumper, because I was just like, I can't. I'm just putting, I'm picking out my comfiest thing. I don't care. I don't care about being super cute right now. I just want to be comfy because last night was so rough. But I'm gonna try to look at it as it's a new day. Just. Just try to live for today, live in the present. Not worry about yesterday. I was gonna vlog like more last night, but I didn't think this this thing was gonna happen, so. And you guys probably like, Zoe, stop saying the thing and just tell us what the frick it is. But I don't want to. Someone may see this and then I don't want them to know that I'm telling you this, you know, without their permission. I'm not gonna ask for their permission. But let's stop talking about that. Let's talk about something else. It's 6.04 on Tuesday, which is, you know, normal day. Tuesday, February 21st. Thursday's my mom's birthday. Oh, my mom is leaving for New York today. She's gonna be out today and tomorrow. Then she's coming back on her birthday and then for dinner, my dad's taking her out just without the Zachary. So that should be fun. But what what is? But let's just say Thursday. Thursday might be a lit night for me and Zach. You know. Yesterday, Zachary and I were gonna watch The Bachelor together. I really don't have much else to say. I I, I really want to like kind of hard like work out harder today than normal because i don't know i just feel like pushing myself a little bit kind of energizing myself more because i you know i'm tired and didn't really sleep well last night i was up in the middle of the night you know i just didn't sleep well so i'm gonna work out maybe to energize myself just work out a little more work out a little higher intensity but yeah i'm just gonna get, continue with my morning and i have nothing really else today Hey guys, it's like three something, and apparently I had a doctor's appointment. I have a doctor's appointment right now. It's at 3.30 and it's like 3.20 or something. And so I just basically got home. I grabbed a couple apple chips just for a little snack. I'm sad I wanted a smoothie. Well, hopefully I can get back and I can make one if I'm still hungry, which I probably will be. I just grabbed a couple of these just to satisfy my hunger. And uh, I had a rough day social problems not gonna get into it i'm gonna try to not talk about that much i don't want my words to be used against me you guys know if you're in middle school about middle school drama but i am gonna go to my doctor's appointment just for you know you really check up because my birthday was just like a little over two weeks ago so 
So, honestly, another horrible day. It's 5 o'clock. I need to get started on my sweet potatoes. I wanted lentil pasta, and I don't have any. But my mom just left. She's going to New York. I can have more dried apples because we did not think we were going to be at the doctor for that long. But I had to do a bunch of stuff. Because apparently I'm very unhealthy. My diet is very unhealthy, so I'm happy to eat more fats and stuff. But I have to go to the nutritionist. I have to go to a cardiologist. I have to go to an orthopedist for my scoliosis. Uh, I have to call my doctor in two months. I need to eat more fats, protein, calories. And all of this is not, it just didn't make me very happy to hear, obviously. I mean, everything else is healthy. Yeah, you know, my heart is fine and my blood pressure is normal and but I'm not gaining any weight. I haven't grown at all since I last was measured. I actually lost a couple ounces. And I'm I'm not happy at all with that. And I had a I just had a very shitty day today. It's time for some very comfort food. Okay, I'm gonna have potatoes. Sweet potatoes, rice beans. I wish I had some olives. Cause she made me want to eat more fats, but like I don't like the taste of most healthy fats. I don't love I don't really like avocados that much. I don't I just don't like the feeling of oil on my food. No, but I like olives. And I don't have any. I don't like nuts. And uh, seeds I'm just kinda like uh, Whatever, I'm gonna do my best to incorporate you guys to like start adding adding seeds into like my smoothies. Eating more like chickpeas and stuff. I don't know anymore. But it's five o'clock and I still haven't started my dinner yet and I'm stressed and I didn't do I didn't have a crap ton of homework to do and I ah, I'm so stressed out. And I have to edit my whole video because we were at the doctor for so long. It took forever to print out all the stuff we needed. Hey guys, it's 9.45. I'm not going to bed anytime soon, unfortunately. But my dad brought home little desserts from Gangster Vegan. And that's what I showed you, these little chocolate balls. They were pretty good. I didn't like them that much, but they were pretty good. But my dad also brought home those pies I showed, which I'm gonna try tomorrow. But like, my, my stomach hurts so bad. I feel really nauseous. I don't feel like I'm gonna throw up, but I feel nauseous. I don't know if that makes any sense. But my dad keeps telling me it's because I'm stressed because I have still have work to do. I mean, I've been productive, I've been getting work done, but like, still have more to do. And I'm just stressed out about a lot of things. I just did not have a good day. A lot of bad things happened today. You know, name calling, teachers noticing that I'm upset and then asking to talk to me about it, going to the doctor and having her, having them do all these things and and I got shots in my arms today and now my arms are really sore. I got two in here and one in here. This one doesn't really hurt as bad. These two hurt. One it was like for like to avoid some STD and then like one was like to avoid like hepatitis or something. Things that are found in Mexico, like a thing that's mostly found in Mexico or something. Telling me to do all these things. <sighs> uh, but for dinner I had whatever sloppy joe, sloppy zoe stuff Ooh. I had left. Just a little bit of rice and beans, sweet potatoes, potatoes, some tomato soup. I feel like crap right now and then I had a dessert ball which was it tasted okay but it, I don't think it agreed with me and I watched The Bachelor with my brother while I was eating which was nice and I've just been working on my homework for a while and I still have more to do and I'm honestly so exhausted it's 10 11 now I, I want to go to sleep like I I can barely keep myself awake 
Like, I'm sure that I can do this. I, I would be able to do this all if I was way more awake. I'm sorry that I'm vlogging and I'm being so negative. Every morning I wake up and I say, today is gonna be a more positive day than yesterday. And then it winds up sucking. I'm sorry. I really, I want to be happy and I want to make happy vlogs and but that's honestly not my reality, unfortunately. And I think the reason that I'm so stressed, that my stomach hurts is because I'm so stressed out. And so my stress is causing my stomach to hurt. I have, this is only, this is, I still need to drink a whole other one of these before I go to sleep. And uh, it's been really hard for me to drink anything because my stomach hurts so bad. But you guys know I used to have that stomach problem it went away and now it just comes back every time I'm super stressed and I've been super stressed for a while and I'm just like done I don't want to do this like I have like for my history I say I have all the information written down here I just have to like put it in paragraph format but like I'm, but then I have to finish my English essay, English essay. And I'm just, I'm so exhausted. I just, I just want to go to sleep. It's painful. This is painful. <sighs> My dad's been helping me, but this is, this is tough, guys. This is really tough. But I'm just going to end today's video here. I need to get changed. I, like, I clean my face and my ears and stuff because I needed to take a break from this. About, like, an hour ago. I just want to go to sleep. I know I keep saying that. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm hoping tomorrow will be a better day, but like, my mom's not here. I don't know. My ears are sore. And I don't want to deal with any more social problems, even though unfortunately I just, I know I'm going to. I just, I don't want to, but you know. I can't really avoid it at this point. But I'm going to try to finish this all out and not go to bed too late. I'm, I'm just trying to get to bed before 11 here. Even though I wanted to be in bed 15 minutes ago. If you like this video, give it a big thumbs up. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and share this video and my channel to those who think might be interested. And leave me comments down below. Comment of the day will be, what time are you watching this? Like, what time is it right now when you're seeing me say this <laughs> and now it's 10 15 for me so don't tell me in the comments what time is it for you right now so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed love you bye